Hey guys, it's Core Ross and welcome to 6 News. So we found out that in Season 3, the map rework that is on the roadmap is going to be Hereford Base and they showed us it and it looks freaking gorgeous. So I believe this is mostly concept art. If you zoom in, uh, you can tell that a lot of the aspects of it are two-dimensional so it looks like it's just been kind of drawn out rather than built already. But it looks incredible. I, I, I love it. I absolutely love it. It's like, it is Hereford Base set in the past and although it's similar in some ways you can see that staircase going up the side it's in a different position from the usual it it just looks great i'm loving it and i was kind of worried this year because we're only getting two new maps but this is basically a whole new map so i'm super looking forward to this it's going to have different materials as well so we're going to have a lot of brick we're going to have different destructible types of walls inside as well so I'm super looking forward to this. It just looks gorgeous. I cannot get over how good it looks. And look at those Spitfires just sitting there at the entrance. I wonder if you can actually walk over to them and check them out. That would be sweet. And all the old school planes and that and the Chinooks in the background. Love it. Really good. They also let us know that Yacht is returning to Rainbow Six Siege. But no news on Favela. They also let us know that every season, starting from season 2, they're hoping to do a what they call a map buff. And they'll come into old maps and just improve. They'll take out a few problem areas, add in a few kind of changes like the, we see in this uh, example from Clubhouse. This is what they're hoping they're going to launch at season 2. But they said they're not going to launch it unless it's good. So we'll have to see how this plays out, but they're hoping to do one of these uh, map buffs every single season from year, from season two onwards. So that will be really sweet. So guys, tell me what you think in the comments below. What do you think of this Hereford rework? As you know, I freaking love it. I'm amazed and I think it looks incredible. Uh, but let me know if you agree with me or am I just getting a little bit too hyped over this? Anyway guys, thanks for watching and I will catch you next time.